back to Tong Soang Mushroom Farm. Um, we're on the 2nd, oh no, actually it's the 3rd of January 2021. So tomorrow I think everything starts opening back up as best it can before Covid bites hard again. But I just wanted to go over the um, system I've just put in for humidification. Um, Kind of built it up myself just based on experience and, and equipment available so um, i'm gonna flip the camera around and I'll, I'll just give you a breakdown of how i've built it and show you how it works so the system starts with i've, I've got um, a large bucket bin whatever you want to call it with the lid on um, i'm using RO because in um, Thailand you don't tend to drink the tap water so we've got a filter and it basically uses reverse osmosis to, to clean the water so I'm putting that in the system because it's better for the fogging discs so we start off that's the reserve tank um, I've just put the tap on there and hose is then running through into this 60 litre um, plastic bin and we've got a ball valve there so set the level that I want um, that fills up I, I want to show you inside so you get an idea so there's the um, actual pond fogger that was bought shipped from China um, I think I paid the I think it was about two 2500 bar with the transformer which is there um, the discs in it are replaceable the, the, the reason I'm using RO water is because it gives you a far longer um, disc life on the on the you see the 10 little discs there they, they're replaceable but from experience back in the UK I found if you use normal tap water um, them discs take a hammer in they don't last too long so our RO is the way to go. So yeah, so that's the, the, the tank with the um, yeah, ball valve there, uh, or ball cock, whatever you want to call it. So once it's at the right level, and it doesn't use a lot of water to be fair. Um, so that's the tank itself. Then we've got the input fan. So this fan, um, again, shipped from China as pretty much everything is these days so that draws in fresh air fresh air in here that's then forced into the tank then the fogger comes on creates fog within that tank and then that is then pumped into this pipe system that I've run in now you see I've got two pipes the lower pipe um, that's for feeding the mist into the growing chambers and then this upper one is for drawing out the CO2 they're both on I've, I've got to tidy the wiring up but they're both on these sun off switches which I've shown in previous videos so they're fully programmable um, I've got to check humidity and stuff once I've got this up and running properly but I tend to from experience I tend to run the fan so I'll run the fogger for one minute, off for three. Um, and then after two minutes of, of the fogger being off, we kick in the exhaust fans. So that exhaust for one minute before the fresh um, mist gets pumped in. Um, so the pipe system, I've basically got I've got I'm waiting for a core drill to come, four inch core drill, so I can drill through. But these, where it's teed here, that's where the I'm going to drill a hole here into the these chambers. So each chamber has got um, a feed in and a feed out for taking the CO2. That's the way round, um, and then I can extend here. So these are just temporary. So as I move on to further cells, I can just extend it out. I'm not sure the capacity until I run it up. Um, and I'll just flick 
this on. So that's, this is where the um, fog will come out. There's, as I say, there's a hole to be drilled in there and then I'll feed it through. Um, but yeah, let's just flick this on so you can see it in action. So at the moment, the, the, the um, sequence is switched off, but I can manually switch it on, simply press that button fan kicks in so you may I'm not sure whether you can hear the fan or not so the fan kicks in then switches the fogger on so that we create fog in the tank there and then as you can see we get some fog there you probably get a better idea here so we, we're creating quite a lot of fog um, which is obviously once in them chambers the uh, humidity levels go up. I'll, I'll run some tests and see. Um, I want to be running at night.